hi guys welcome back to my another news of today okay romance cam Ghanaian arrested in the u.s for alleged role in five million dollars fraud a young Ghanaian guy based in the u.s is in the grips of the u.s authorities for his alleged involvement in an extensive crime syndicate kenneth anim 38 years was arrested on july 12th after the fbi led an investigation to unravel his alleged in various criminal activities including romance scam in convicted anim faces up to 20 years in prison and a possible five hundred thousand dollars maximum fine guys this is really very very crazy a young Ghanaian man is in the grips of the United States law enforcement authorities for allegedly abating various crimes activities, including romance scams, to the tune of $5 million. According to the U.S. Attorney Office, Kenneth Anim, 38 years, and his co-conspirator created individual sham businesses from 2014 to 2019. They also allegedly operated as money malls, considering various mail and wire fraud schemes, including internet fraud and romance scams. Guys, what do you guys think about it? Okay, my name is Uncut with Ujulin. And I'm here to bring you guys unedited news, undilated news, everything uncut, okay? So I came across this news on the internet. I decided to share it on my space. And at the same time, I would like to know what you think about it. If this is your first time, please consider subscribing to my channel for more news, for more entertainment. And I would like to know your honest opinion in the comment section. So let's proceed to the news of today. According to the U.S. authorities, Kenneth, who holds both U.S. and Ghanaian citizenship, is the main person who allegedly transferred illegal acquired money on behalf of and at the direction of others in a crime syndicate. The U.S. Federal Bureau of Investigation FBI stated that FBI young Kenneth allegedly played a role of a money mall in the suspicious operation. Dozens of unsuspecting dozens of unsuspecting people have been victims of the crime syndicate that has stolen more than five million dollars from them. Although Kenneth and Yam's parents and children live in the hosting, he spent months at a time in Ghana, the officials said. Kenneth Aniam was taken into custody on July 12, 2022, and made his first appearance before U.S. Magistrate Judge Peter Bray on the same day. So this brings us to the end of this news. Let me know what you think about it. And if case if you've not subscribed please hit the subscribe button to be part of this family it is totally free and i promise you you'll be updated okay thank you so much once again and i will see you all in my next video remain blessed and be kind bye guys